All right, hello everyone, thanks for being here. Appreciate it, we're gonna be fast and furious the next 15 minutes or so. Uh, as she mentioned, I'm from Teradata in the cloud marketing area. We're gonna cover a lot, but if you remember nothing else from the next 15 minutes, I want you to remember these three things. First of all, Teradata loves AWS. So for the longest time, we've had our own infrastructure that we deployed in customer data centers on-premises. Many people think that we're um, not embracing the cloud. Nothing further from the truth. We're all in in the cloud, particularly with AWS. We have two offerings. I'm going to go through those real briefly. Number two, our software is consistent everywhere. And this is important, particularly for existing customers who want to move into the cloud. You don't want to have to go through a conversion, have to retool things, get new ecosystem components. It's the exact same software everywhere, on-premises, in the cloud, whether it's AWS, Azure, VMware, you name it. And last but not least, we have services to help you, whether that's migrating, which is the focus of this discussion, or whether it's architecting, uh, just a point in the right direction, helping hand, or full-on managing the environment. We have services to help you. So let's jump right into it. So as I mentioned, we're all in on the cloud, particularly with AWS. We're an advanced technology partner and an advanced consulting partner. So we've invested quite a lot in terms of time and money and uh, focus. You can see we've gone through seven well-architected reviews, so the architecture of our services are, are quite rigorous. And you can see at the bottom of the screen, individual Teradata associates are quite invested. Over 5,000 associates have AWS accreditations, including myself, technical and business accreditations. And then we have over 120 associates with AWS certifications. So that just goes to show our level of investment. So the 5,000, that's like half of our employee base, AWS accreditation. So we're all in with AWS. Our strategy, our go-to-market, we call it Teradata Everywhere. And the idea is these four attributes are key to Teradata Everywhere. Analyze anything, deploy anywhere, buy any way, and move any time. Now, I'm gonna, not going to go through all four of these in the next 15 minutes, but basically what I'm going to focus on is deploy anywhere. That's part of the migration, right? You've got whether you deploy on-premises, whether you deploy in AWS, whether you deploy in Azure, whether it's in VMware. Same software regardless of deployment choice. Buy any way means subscription-based as well as perpetual, whatever you want, and then move any time. That's migrating from one area to the next. We have two main offerings in AWS. A managed offering we call IntelliCloud, where we manage it for you. You can see all the things there in the stack. We're going to go through this a bit more. But basically, it's our software, our services, our support on AWS infrastructure. And then we have a do-it-yourself option on AWS Marketplace. We'll go into these real briefly. So think of IntelliCloud as like a home that's been designed and built just for you. We thought of your customer requirements. We've built the structure. We have security and maintenance that are part of it. We maintain the perimeter. We never go inside your house, so it's up to you to bring your furniture, your data, as it were. We never go in the house, so it's completely private and, trans and, and secure. You're responsible for your own data and analytics, but we take care of the entire environment for you. That's, that's the analogy for IntelliCloud. For example, a marquee customer of ours, Monsanto, large multinational agricultural company, about $13.5 billion dollar revenue firm. They had Teradata on-premises. They extended into Teradata IntelliCloud on AWS because they want Teradata, they want to be in the AWS environment, but they didn't want to have to manage it themselves. So this is an ideal use case for Teradata on AWS via IntelliCloud. Here's what the stack looks like. It's Teradata software on the top, and then standard AWS infrastructure underneath that, EC2 resources, EBS, and so on. So this is the, everything in that rectangle is part of the IntelliCloud service offering. Again, this is a comprehensive package. The line items, what's included in the service, are listed there in the table. You can see onboarding assistance, provisioning assistance, system monitoring, system maintenance. It's a secure environment. We've got, you can see in the upper right, ISO 27001, SOC 1 and 2, PCI and HIPAA audits. We do daily, weekly, or monthly backups, encryption of data in motion and at rest. It's a full-on offering, offered at a flat rate subscription price, either monthly, one year, three year. We characterize it as just bring your data in a DBA, and we'll manage the environment for you. And so this is a great offering for those who want to be in a particular environment, want to do cloud data warehousing on AWS, but they don't want to have to manage it themselves. That was the managed offering, we call that IntelliCloud. Now we're gonna shift gears and talk about the do-it-yourself offerings, more a la carte. So the idea here is there are two flavors of our do-it-yourself offering. 
AWS Marketplace and BYOL, or Bring Your Own License. Either way, it's all the same software. This is one of our key differentiators from anybody else in the marketplace, is we have consistent software regardless of where it's deployed. That's the deploy anywhere. And with AWS Marketplace or BYOL, this is for companies who want to get in under the hood and do it themselves. They don't want the managed offering where we take care of it for them. They'd rather get in there and dial it in. Regardless, everything is supported by Teradata. You don't have to go through AWS to get support of, of your software. Customer example here would be Seven West Media, Australia-based media company with web, TV, online uh, presence and they wanted to stream the events of the Rio Olympic Games last year, the Summer Olympics. They were not an existing Teradata customer. It took only three weeks to go from basically zero to 100 miles an hour working with our services team. We got them stood up in the AWS Sydney region and they did all their analytics on the consumers who uh, consumed that data the, of the various Olympic Games and they used that to feed targeted marketing programs and they had a 29% uplift in minutes of use consumed. So very um, you know, concise success story here of company wanting to deploy Teradata in AWS using the do-it-yourself option. The purpose of this slide is to illustrate it's a wide library of software. It's not just Teradata database. It's not a second class experience. It's a full first class experience. So it's all the different ecosystem components of an analytic ecosystem. So you can see for monitoring, for moving data, for querying data in different repositories, Aster analytics for multi-genre analytics, et cetera. So the idea is wherever you want deployed, whether it's AWS or Azure or on-prem or VMware, all the Teradata software is available for that and however you want to consume it. Speaking of making it easy to buy, we've got Teradata and Telesphere. This is a bundle of software, formerly sold individually. It was all the cart piecemeal. And uh, what we've done to make it easier for customers is bundle this into a package we call Intellisphere. So you get all these things and there's no additional charge for, for using any of them. That's, that's bundled into the, the Intellisphere bundle. So let's talk about migration. How do you get into AWS, whether you're an existing on-premises customer or not? Well, First of all, I want to reiterate the move anywhere aspect of our strategy. The whole point here is we want to make it easy for customers to move from any environment to any other environment. Technology evolves so rapidly these days, it's easy to kind of get uh, analysis paralysis, trying to figure out where exactly you need to deploy, and you're concerned about what might change in the future. It's hard to predict more than you know, six months, much less two or three years or, or longer. So that's why we make it easy for customers to move their workloads because you never know what new requirements are going to come up, what new acquisitions are going to take place, what new services are going to be offered in one environment versus the next. So we make it easy for customers to move because that software is 100% consistent and the, the licenses are portable between these environments. We always recommend that customers start with a cloud workshop. The reason for this, there are so many myths and misconceptions and false assumptions about what is in the cloud, what is capable performance-wise, security-wise, uh, data movement, you name it, there's all sorts of uh, misinformation out there. So what we like to do first with customers is, is level set. Let's talk about your business objectives, your IT strategy, where you have data now, what your strategy is going forward. Do you want to be in AWS? Do you not want to be in a, a particular type of environment? Do you want to get out of your data center? We kind of lay all that out and discuss the, the pros and cons of different alternatives, not to guide you in any particular direction, but just to make sure that, that what you plan to do has been well thought out and we can help kind of point out some best practices there. So cloud workshop, this can be anywhere from a half day to a couple days depending on how deep you want to go. That's the first thing. Then we have a cloud architecture service. This is like the next step. Once you've kind of figured out what direction you want to go, let's say specifically in AWS, you know, which regions maybe, or do you want to have multiple uh, availability zones, what levels of, of high availability do you want, what's instance types, and then we can design you know, what data and applications need to be migrated into the AWS environment. Depending on how much data and what sort of network connection you have, maybe we'll transfer that data over the network or maybe we'll use a, a portable storage device like a Snowball or something similar where you know, plug in, bulk download, physically send it, and then upload into the environment, or a combination of both. It doesn't have to be either or, and that's the great thing about a hybrid strategy is you have 
options and we combine these together for the best overall mix. So the architecture service is that next step. It, it includes our architects and yours. You know, we're not telling you what to do, but you know, we're guiding you in many cases. Customers want that helping hand. They want to help us or have us look over their shoulder to make sure that they're employing best practices and not you know, going down a path where they're going to get stuck or, or, or you know, not, not get the results that they need from the environment. And then last but not least, the cloud migration service. This is literally physically moving the data and applications into the cloud environment. Now, some applications you're going to want to have in close proximity to your data for that low latency connectivity. Other applications that may not be necessary. So that's why we say it's not a one size fits all. It's not like you have to move everything into the cloud environment. You need to be smart about what you move, when, how long, and then phase it, and then do it in a way where um, if there's a problem and you need to step back and, and roll back, that you know, we've planned that. So migration services where we can physically help your team move into the cloud environment and whether that's just a lift and shift from one Teradata deployment to another, or whether it's converting or migrating from a different database, different schemas and so on, and employing industry data models and you know, getting the new system dialed in. And then from there, we can step back and walk away and you know, hand the keys to you. Or if you want, many customers like us to stick around and kind of help manage that environment for them. Everything is optional. There's no set path. There's no one size fits all. We like to, to choose, you know, figure out what's best for you what works for the customer. So hopefully you can see that you know, these three things I told you to remember, we're all in in the cloud, specifically with AWS. We love AWS. We've got two offerings, our managed offering and telecloud, or the do-it-yourself offerings, whether it's marketplace or bring your own license. It's the same software everywhere. It's consistent. That makes it easy to migrate from one environment to the next. And you're never stuck. You're never locked in technology-wise or vendor-wise or deployment mode-wise. You can change and move. And in fact, we encourage that with our licensing strategy. And then we have these services available to help you do that. You're not on your own. We realize it's overwhelming. I mean, just this week, you know, there's like dozens of new service offerings. It's hard for any one person or team to keep on top of all that. That's why having, you know, kind of the helping hand of subject matter experts, and this is all we do and our team all we do all day long, Speaking of our team, I have a number of colleagues in, in the audience here and, and outside who are able to discuss with you if you want to talk about some of these migration services and things like that. Whether it's right here after this session or down the hall, we're booth 104, it's right on the very corner um, as you're you know, kind of exiting here. We'd be happy to talk with you about your particular environment, maybe set up a call to go, go deeper afterward. So that pretty much wraps up my presentation. We have two minutes for any questions. I'm happy to take them. Um, or I'll give you two minutes back and you can uh, get prepared for your next activity. Any questions? All right, we'll call it a wrap. Thank you very much for showing up. Appreciate it. Enjoy the rest of your reInvent.